Yeah, I was gonna run Sortle after this, after I got it, get a 37, but I'm gonna put that on the back burner. Run some Demon Souls instead. Yeah, I just, I think I need a break from DS1. I don't, I don't think Sordal is going to be, like, going to make me feel better. <laughs> going to make me less frustrated or anything. So, yeah, I'm going to run some Demon Souls for something fresh and new. Yeah, no, fuck that, damn. I wouldn't do that. <laughs> you can have a little demon souls. What's up, Hayes? Yeah, I I saw you lose a lot of runs late from like Manus and after. That's always frustrating. I mean, I've lost a fuck ton of runs in this category to Nito. But that's kind of just what you sign up for when you try to run this at a high level. That was bad stamina. Man. Yeah, well, most of the stuff after ONS before the DLC is pretty easy, so that makes sense. That's the thing, Gamero. It's not just the past few weeks. <laughs> it's like the past ten years. <laughs> Nito's been a fucking piece of shit in this, in this category. Nito's always been trash in this category. When, when you're going for optimal times. If you're not going for a super optimal time, Nito is like the easiest fight in the run. But as soon as you start doing RTSR Nito, holy shit, he's a fuckface. Not to mention, in like, you can just die to, like, bone wheels on the way to Nito. Like, that whole segment's just scuffed. But yeah, I mean, you're right, Gamero. It's just... That's not a new thing. I've I've lost so many fucking runs to Nito, it's disgusting. Like since I've started doing Arceus R Nito. Nito accessories, yeah. <laughs> hey Chippy. I didn't mean to jump there. Yeah, I'm gonna run emulator uh any percent thirty FPS. The plunge can go bad, too. It's just not a very nice segment.
Uh, Sordal is um, an all bosses route chippy for Dark Souls Prepare to Die Edition. S uh, Sordal Mage. Because uh, you uh, you start with the Black Knight Greatsword as your main source of damage. And then after the DLC, you turn into a mage using Dark Beat. So Sordal Mage. Oh, you get another attempt at a suicide. Nice, it worked that time. Dude, let's fucking go. Dream tier luck. Dude, yeah, I know. That's four out of five streak for halberds and one of them was a suicide uh that's just been kind of a naming convention that have been used for dark souls runs it's 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 the name of the route gamer it's not the name of the category like there's crapple mage there's blackle mage there's sortal mage and it's, it's supposed to be a play on the idea of being like a, a battle mage because you use melee and magic. That's where it comes from. But yeah, those are just the names of the routes for all bosses. up my menu ring that's okay lost a couple frames whatever uh the main weapon in crapple mage is just magic like you see what kata does i see kata is currently running crapple mage in the remaster Rando and mods mostly now, yeah. Yeah, Crapple Mage is just almost pure sorcery. Like... You use melee on gargoyles. That's pretty much it. The rest of it's just sorcery. That was pretty good, except for the bow shot. <sighs> Wasn't that great, but otherwise, really good start. Oh, damn, dude. <laughs> I don't know if that guy's ever come that close to hitting me.
Oh, I guess you use um melee on Taurus Demon as well. Yeah. This might be sub eleven forty. Nice, eleven thirty nine. Yeah, I didn't stand up at the bonfire. <laughs> I stood up at the bonfire after I did everything. <laughs> That's the important part. Hey, they didn't kill me on the fast run. That's good.
That's not the fastest Silver Knight, but whatever. I got a pretty big cushion here. Yeah, they they can do that, but I handled it well. You actually can you have ways to deal with the silver knights, unlike the dagger on rafters. Can't do anything about that. Ooh, yikes. That was okay fight. I got the shovel from Smo, but otherwise that was good. I, I got the counter hit at least, so I got the R1 finish him. Yeah, too bad I lost time on the Silver Knights, otherwise this would be um, sub-1540 ONS. Drop the fucking th dude. Holy shit. Well, I just lost a <laughs> some time on that fucking menuing. Unfortunate. Oh, I, I hope that wasn't too early, man. Uh, it might have been too early. Nope, we're good. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, this is kind of a slow segment, but whatever. I didn't lose that much time. I lost a few seconds. Hey, Bamalo. Any branchers? Oh my dog, I didn't die. Oh my god, I, I got caught on that branch though.
Okay, asshole. Don't you fucking meme me. Branch sends its regards, yeah. Well, he's doing the same thing he did last time. Let's see if he jumps away. Okay, he didn't jump away. He, he derped out, but he didn't jump away. Okay, asshole. Hi, bun dumpling. I probably lost like two or three seconds to that Titan Knight demon. Yep.
fucking dude end my life man i can't tell you how much i practice this fucking skip and i still just miss it i hate to skip so fucking much it's the hardest skip in the run like fuck blight town skip I don't know how much I have to practice that fucking skip to stop missing it in runs. It's so triggering, man. Oh, I've lost like 10 seconds already on the segment, dude. I might not lose that much time versus my PB, though, because my PB sift segment's also bad. But, Jesus Christ, dude. I could have been, like, 25 seconds ahead. Instead, I'm going to be, like, 10 seconds ahead. Maybe a little more. We'll see. Depends on what you do. Yeah, I agree, Benino. You know. I've never done it on the remaster, though. I wouldn't be surprised if it was worse on the remaster. For whatever reason. Nice menuing. Yeah, I'm sure it's still bad, but I feel like it might be worse. I wouldn't know. I haven't done it. The only, like, speedrun I'd done on the remaster was the, um... Uh, any percent with purple, purple Coward's Crystal. Before we even had dupes, so... I'm not sure about a lot of things. Like the small things. Yeah, the first route. Although, well, it was like the second iteration, the one that I did, but it was not that much different. I could get a gold there. Well, the um, the route that I did, the the main difference was that um, you got extra endurance after ONS because uh, you did different warps. And instead of dark signing away all your souls, 
after Quilog, you used a homeward bone after Quilog, and it, and it it saved like three seconds or something over what Ella did. So it was a very small iteration of the original route. Mm, this gold tastes better. Yeah, it's a good gold. I knew that I could gold that by a little bit. That was a really clean segment, so... I guess I'm taking this way. There's fucking hogs, yeah. That only lost me, like, two seconds because I didn't do the up warp. It's not a big deal. this I guess that should work though that's a chunky time loss though like maybe like six seconds right there yeah. I'll still I should still be like 10 seconds ahead after this segment though Unless something else goes wrong. Those clams are pretty sketch. Imagine if I hadn't missed Ruin Skip in this run. I could probably do no RTSR Nito and still get a 37.
If I just hadn't lost 11 seconds on C-Segment. I may have lost more than that. It might have been like 12. 12 seconds. Fuck this game! Fuck this game! Hey Vic. Yeah, I probably can't get a 37 now. Yeah, that skeleton will do that. That's another way that you can lose your run on this segment. Isn't that great? I'm honestly lucky I didn't die. I don't I don't know, uh on dumpling. I think I lost too much time. I'm not sure how much time I lost there, but it was a good bit. Yeah, more Nito accessories. That was pretty bad luck. That roll look concerning? I don't know. That's how I always do it, Dan. Good job, Relay. All right, let's see how much time we lost. Yeah, I don't think I can do it. <sighs> I still could have gotten a 37, though, if I didn't fucking miss Ruin Skip. Hey, good job, Relayed. Yeah, slip quit out too. I lost like seven seconds to slip quit out. Yeah, skeleton just ruined it. Yeah, definitely some time losses in this run. Although it was, this run has a lot of good stuff in it, but then a few like key time losses. But as long as Gwyn doesn't troll me, I'll take a PB, you know, I haven't PB'd in two months. 
But I mean, I could. If Gwyn trolls me, then I just won't get a PB. So, it's not guaranteed. We have to see what Gwyn does. Hey, Gwyn didn't screw us over! The 3803. Ah, getting closer. Getting closer. I've, I'm just happy I PB'd.